how to apply for the official WhatsApp business API. In this video, I'm going to take you through the entire step by step process by which you can easily get your WhatsApp business API. I'm also going to discuss the various prerequisites to increase your chance of success. So without further ado, let's start the show. My name is Anthony and I'm the founder of Alpha Marketer and we are entering episode number eight of the conversational marketing show. This is your go to show to learn about conversational marketing and turn those conversations into conversions. Now, first, let's look at the prerequisites. Before you apply for the WhatsApp business API, you should have these four prerequisites. Number one, you should have a brand new phone number. Okay, don't use any old phone number which already had a WhatsApp account. Safer side, go buy a brand new phone number. That's number one. Number two, your business should be verified on the Facebook business manager account. This is done to verify the authenticity of your business. And for that, you have to upload your business proofs and some of your government ID cards. I have done a step by step video on how to get your business verified on Facebook business manager account. So you can check out the link will be in the description. Number three, your business should comply with the WhatsApp business policy and the WhatsApp commerce policy. So there are two different policies. WhatsApp business policy simply, you know, kind of summarizes that you should have the consent of people before sending them the WhatsApp messages through their API. So this can be done in two ways. Number one, on your website, where if there is a form, you can add an opt-in where people can explicitly mention that, yes, they want to receive information or uh, communication from your business through WhatsApp. That is one option. Number two, if you enable people to start the conversation with your business, for example, now you have the option of creating a WhatsApp link with a pre-filled message. Okay. So what you have to do is create a pre-filled message link and use that link in your landing pages, use that link on your ads. And when people click on your ads or landing pages, they open the WhatsApp interface on their phone and they will start the chat conversation. When your buyers, your visitors, your customers start the conversation, then you have no problem. You can start communicating with your customers through WhatsApp business API. Okay. So that is the WhatsApp business policy in short. WhatsApp commerce policy is basically WhatsApp has some uh, restrictions on what products you should be selling or promoting on WhatsApp. They have made a list of, you know, uh, services and products that you should not be promoting on WhatsApp. Just go and check it. I will leave the link to the WhatsApp commerce policy below this video. Do check it out if your business falls under those categories. Okay. Lastly, you need a WhatsApp business solutions provider. So you cannot directly apply to WhatsApp. Okay. For the WhatsApp API, it has to come through what we call as a BSP, which is WhatsApp business solution provider. Nothing but the software companies out there, which are acting as a reseller of the WhatsApp API. Okay. So you have products like Zoco, Wati, AISNC, Interact, Line Chat. There are so many softwares today in the market which are the WhatsApp business solution provider BSPs. Okay. So you can use these softwares to apply for the official WhatsApp business API. So in this video, for the sake of example, I am going to use the Zoco WhatsApp marketing software. I will take you through the uh, Zoco interface and let's, let's go step by step and, and fill in the form and understand how to get your WhatsApp API approved. Right. Let's get started. API. It's a very simple process. So first we need to create an account here. So I'm going to give my email ID. Okay. And I'm going to set up a password. Create. So the next step, uh, it will ask you for your Facebook business manager ID. 
so it's important that you have to have a verified facebook business manager account okay so if you have a facebook business manager there are, there are options in, within that uh, you know interface to verify your business once you verify uh, you can go and get your facebook business manager id okay so how do you get it um if you go to your facebook business manager uh, in, in the interface on the in the top you will have a url okay this is the business id okay uh, so you can see the business id here so this number I had to copy and you have to paste it here submit and then here you have to give the phone number that you want to use as the official whatsapp number for your business okay so there is one important condition that you should use a brand new phone number which does not have any whatsapp account active right now okay so my recommendation go and get a brand new phone number that's all very simple Okay, and now it will ask you to mention the uh, display details, uh, but make sure that whatever you are giving is, is like final, you cannot change it later. Okay, so I'm going to give again for my purpose, I'm going to apply for a demo bot. Okay, so it's it's alpha, alpha demo bot. Okay, but you choose your name carefully. If it's your brand name, put your brand name here. You can't change it uh, later. And then. Um, uh, the brand image so basically upload your logo I'm gonna upload my logo here right that is done click on submit so now it is going to uh, ask us some more information legal entity of your business name Mine is alpha marketer status. I'm going to enter a text saying questions happy to help. This is basically your WhatsApp status. Okay. You can type whatever you want. The description. I'm going to say that we are. for e-commerce businesses or I'll just say yeah so you have 256 characters to mention so use it wisely address I need to give my uh, office address website give the website link email ID of your like your business email so of course it should have a proper business domain link to it don't give you know abcd at gmail.com it should be your business uh, you know email with your domain name okay category i am an agency so i will be under professional services country india okay so submit and here we need to enter the contact information okay just in case uh, during the application if there's any problem any rejection or any doubts uh, Zoco team will get in touch with us for that purpose they are going to ask us the name email and phone number so enter your details also select the right country here and once you click click on submit the application will be true okay so I'm not clicking on submit here because I have already applied so if you click on submit the application is through very simple process and once it is through there will be a, a time delay of say or, or, or the general timeline to get it approved is five to eight days so within eight days you will get your uh, you know confirmation from zoco team whether your uh, api has been approved or not in case if there are any problem in terms of the details that you mentioned they'll get in touch with you and get it fixed okay so that's how simple it is to apply for a whatsapp business api 
Hope you enjoyed this video. If you are an e-commerce business and you want to implement WhatsApp conversational marketing for your business, then you can hire us. Or if you want to learn WhatsApp conversational marketing, then you can also learn from our coaching and mentorship program. So all you have to do is just go to this link alphamarketer.in slash chat. When you do that, you will be welcomed by my personal WhatsApp sales assistant. It's a chatbot that will guide you through the right process. Alternatively, you can also send me a WhatsApp message. Just send in hi to this number plus 91. That's the country code for India. 733-884-2395. Right? So thank you so much for your time and please do subscribe to this channel and hit the like button. It will help me reach out to more and more people and help businesses grow with WhatsApp conversational marketing. Until next time, see you. Bye-bye.